name is Tristan Bro, and in this tutorial we're going to be learning how to pan fry Alaskan wild caught salmon. Um, there are many health benefits and studies have shown that specifically salmon helps uh, support brain function, reduces inflammation, prevents heart disease. Um, it has many different minerals and vitamins um, inside the fish as well. These are going to be our six main ingredients, which they each have their own health benefits as well. First one we're going to do is extra virgin olive oil. This is going to provide a nice coating for the fish, which is going to make it nice and crispy. A pinch of salt, a drizzle of honey, and a tablespoon of onion powder, garlic powder, and basil. This is going to be our fish. It is 0.8 pounds, which is approximately four servings. Next thing we're going to do is cut the fish out of the packet, which is pretty simple. We're just going to cut the light the film that's on top of it. All right, so once you have your fish out, um, you don't have to do this, but I generally like to, is to cut the skin off. So the best technique I found for doing this is just kind of holding the skin and taking your knife and putting it directly under and just kind of cutting it. You want to try to not get much meat on the skin as you cut it off. That's less meat you'll be getting once you cook it. Any meat you do have on the skin, you could cut off and season that separately, it's not a big deal. Next thing we're gonna do is um, coat the fish. So we have a teaspoon of olive oil and we're just gonna drizzle it just like so all over the fish. Then you're gonna wanna take it and just kinda gently rub it in. It's nice and coated for when you put it in the skillet. All right, the next thing we're gonna do is take our basil leaves Sprinkle it. This is a teaspoon of basil leaves. You don't want to get it on both sides. Kind of estimate how much you like to put it on there. We have our onion powder and garlic powder that we're going to sprinkle on there as well. We're like a half a teaspoon on each side. You just kind of rub it in. We're just going to do a pinch of salt on each um, piece of meat. You're going to want to do it on the front and the back. Just get a nice coating on there. All right, and then we're going to put it in the skillet. Over to the oven, you're going to want to heat your pan to medium heat. Um, you're going to want to add some olive oil just a drizzle in the pan, that way, it doesn't fit, that way your fish doesn't stick as it's um, frying. When it's ready, you just put a dash of water and then it starts sizzling. And then you're just gonna wanna put your fish in there. And when you're pan frying it, it's gonna go to um, five minutes on each side. So we're gonna set our timer, five minutes, and then cover it up. And then after five minutes, we'll check it and flip it up. All right, so our five minutes is up. Uh, you can see it's cooking good in there. So we're gonna go ahead and flip it with our spatula. It's a beautiful color we got it out right now. Nice and crispy. It's not sticking. All right, that's it. So we're gonna put the lid on for another five minutes. And we'll check it back after that. This is up. We're gonna take the lid off. Turn the oven off. Our fish to a nice golden dark brown color. So that's going to be perfect. You want to add a little sweet to it. You could do a drizzle of honey, which I like to do. As we come to the end, I leave you with this. What do you call a fish that wears a bow tie? Sophisticated.